Welcome to the second semi-final in the unofficial Euro 2020 tournament. We've got action here today for you between France and Switzerland. Can Switzerland make the final leap into the final and upset France here? Let's check out today's team news. France are playing a 4-4-1-1 formation today with Hugo Lloris in goal. A back four of Lucas Hernandez, Pomon Longley, Raphael Varane and Benjamin Pavard. In central midfield they have Angolo Kante and Paul Pogba with Blaise Tweedy out on the left and Kylian Mbappe out on the right with Antoine Griezmann in behind Olivier Giroud up front. Switzerland line up in a 5-2-1-2 formation today with Jan Sommer in goal, a back five of Ricardo Rodriguez, Nico Elvedi, Manuel Akanji, Fabian Schaar and Kevin Mbabu with Denis Zakaria and Granit Xhaka in midfield with Jordan Shakiri behind Harris Sererovic and Bril and Bolo up front. It's time for semi-final number two. We've got the joint number one seed in France taking on the number 17, 17 seed Switzerland. World, world beating underdogs with any luck battling away in this one. We've got France shooting from left to right in a 4-4-1-1 formation. We've got Switzerland shooting from right to left in a 5-2-1-2 formation. The referee's ready. We're ready. Everyone, get your Switzerland flags out. Let's go. We're underway in this one. If you don't want Switzerland to win, Get out right now. Get out. You've got to be supporting Switzerland. Everyone wants an underdog to win this one. Let's have the little underdogs scrape for this one as well. Let's see if they can battle through France. It's a bigger ask than the Netherlands game. Netherlands was a hell of a game. This is a whole step up from that one. They've already had a few players injured. We've got a couple of damaged black bears over here. And we've already got a dominant number of players left here for uh, France. Oh, the elephant there. Antoine Griezmann whacks it in, in the back of the net. 30 seconds in, wax it in the back of the net. Not a phrase you hear very often. You don't normally whack it in the net, but you know what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying. They, they go ahead 1 0. And can, is there any chance at all for Switzerland here? They're losing a lot of their more powerful players early on. Here comes Kevin and Bavard. They've got some pace still. And Akanji, Manuel Akanji on the wing. Can Akanji cross this one in? Is that a shot? It's gone across the box. Can they get on this one? Oh, the crocodile. The crocodile of Fabian Shah has a shot, but it's gone. It's gone wide. They've got the pace in all the games. They're the quickest. They're the quicker team in all the games. Gone across the box. I think Jordan Shakiri, the zebra, crossed that one in. We do not. Oh, mbappe has been bashed. Have it. He's still going. He's he's lost a leg though. Mbappe in that in that collision. And there's a bundle in the corner. This is not going to favour Switzerland at all. This is not on Switzerland. Someone's cleared this up forwards. And there's barely anyone left now for Switzerland. This team have been destroyed. There's a black bear left. I believe it might be um, Dennis Zakaria. And this might be 2-0 here. I didn't see who scored that one. I think it might be the Stegosaurus quite possibly there of um, Blaise Matuidi. We'll have to get that one VAR checked. A minute and a half in and it's 2-0 to France. And is this one step too far, unfortunately, for the, for the fantastic Switzerland team? We've really put a good effort in this one. Come on, get it clear, Giraffe. Get it clear. It's gone wide. Can they counter? The problem with this one was the high unit. Mbolo and, Hacer and Harris Arorovic are going to get killed quite quickly. Both were alive in this break. Can they both break clear? Oh, they've got clear here. Severovic, can he put it in? Severovic, can on, tap this one in. Oh, he's missed. How have you missed? You had an open goal. Quick, 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 quick. Breland Bolo is down. Severovic has got time to turn it around. If he can get it, if he can get across the goal here. He's crossed it in, but he's put it wide again. There was your chance, Switzerland. And as per the Netherlands game, you have to take these chances. You can't. You can't give these bigger got these big guns a chance to get to get ahead in these games. Severovic is coming back here. Please clear this one. Oh no. Oh no. And Severovic has put it in his own net. And it's all going a bit wrong for Switzerland at the moment. It's 3-0 now to France. You never know. They need to keep their they need, to, they, they need their pacey players to stay alive. They need to get a couple of lucky breaks. If it goes 4-0, I think it's curtains. But hey, you never you never know in this game. These guys are getting each other's way at the moment. Shakiri and Babu. Can they can they break clear here? Oh, can they get past the China Boa? The China Boa might put his own net here. It's gonna go in his own net. It's 3-1. Come on, Switzerland. Own goal there from Hugo Lloris. Switzerland are not dead and buried. With this much pace in their team, they are not dead and buried. We're at 2 minutes 50 in this game. Switzerland will fight till the end. They're absolute fighters in every game. Don't score another own goal, Severovic. Come on, get this clear. And Severovic is on the break. Can he make up for his own goal here? Can he get past? He's bursting forwards. Come on, Switzerland, make it 3-2. Can they get the ball in the box? Cross it in. The ball's coming in now. They've crossed. Oh, they're putting too much power on these crosses. And uh, he's got the fin back on him now. It's gone back in the area, though. There's so many Switzerland players over here as well. So, oh, this is gonna. This is not going to work well for them. They're getting destroyed. They're getting destroyed. Are there any players still alive? We've got a black bear and a giraffe. It's going to be hard to see those two scoring between themselves. Oh, I think that was that was the um, Triceratops killing them back and making it 4-1. We're at 3 minutes 32. It's looking unlikely, but don't give up on Switzerland just yet. Don't give up on them just yet. They've had three good chances. They've only scored one of them. They can just be more clinical in front of goal here. For the remaining two and a half minutes of this game, this is not over. Laid off there nicely by the giraffe. 
to um, and Brilan Bolo, the hyena. I need to get this one clear though. Oh, it's going dangerous, very dangerous across the goal. Can the, can the giraffe get this one clear? No, he can't. Elephant there. Of Antoine Griezmann puts in for 5 1. And with two minutes left, you fear Switzerland might not be going home. This is a sad day. I think we all had Switzerland in our hearts in this tournament for the, for the way they just, just well, not destroyed. They, the way they battled against Netherlands, especially, they really put in a ridiculous performance there. But I think there's just too much strength here for France. And if they're not careful, this one needs to be cleared. Don't put this on your own net as well. Well done, Jakiri. He gets it clear. Any chance of a little fight back Switzerland? Come on. I think there's just too much There's too much power on this. Great save there from the keeper. Fantastic save there. Oh, he's unfortunately played it straight into Angolo Conte. He makes it 6-1. And Switzerland, unfortunately, are going home. But they're going to be going home proud, I think. There's a minute and a half left of the game. They can go home proud of their achievements. We'll be 17th ranked in the entire tournament and get to the semi-finals when the other three in the final actually are the one, two, and three seeds. It's a great effort. Sverovic, can he make it? Can he get it in here? Oh, he's been taken out. I think he's going to go in anyway. It's 6 2. There's a minute and seven seconds. I mean, let's all hope for a miracle, right, guys? But at least Switzerland have got a couple of goals on the board. They've done fantastically in this tournament. A minute's applause for Switzerland as we see this out, whatever the scoreline ends up here. They're coming forward again. They're trying to put up a good fight at the end. And here comes the black the, the black bear. And can anyone get on this one? Shakira, they're fighting for it. Can they force it over the line? That was a great save from Lloris, to be fair. He's pushed that away fantastically when it looked like it was destined to go in. And now the Finbacks had a long shot. It's missed. It's hit the post. Good. No more for you, please, France. Zverevich is outpacing the fin back. Look at him go. Ball's crossed in. Can they get one more? We've got just over half a minute left in this one. Here comes Kevin and Bavi down the wing. And Zverevich is trying to get past. Oh, they've gone each other's way a bit. That's a shame. Fin back's trying to clear it. Can they get... Come on, Switzerland. Oh, they're being held back by all sorts of France players here. Kanji tries to cross it in. Oh, they can't quite put it in. They've had enough chances to score at least four or five in this game. But they haven't, unfortunately, been clinical enough in front of goal this game. And it's cleared there by the fin back, Olivier Giroud. He's got about five seconds to put this in. Five, four, three, two, one. And sadly for Switzerland, this one is over. Their dreams of making a final appearance are also over in this one. Just unfortunately, France were too much for them in the end. They battled hard. They battled well. But they, their 6-2 defeat here is sad for them. But they have put up a hell of an effort. A round of applause to Switzerland for the efforts in this tournament. They couldn't quite get back in this one, but their Netherlands, their, 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 their defeat of Netherlands in the quarterfinals will be remembered for a lifetime for them. Fair play. This one finishes France 6, Switzerland 2. An almighty effort there from the Switzerland team, but unfortunately France just had too much for them in the end, winning this one 6-2. Switzerland can be proud of their efforts in this tournament though. However, being 17th ranked and getting to semi-finals is one hell of an achievement. Their fans will be very proud of them. It is, however, France that progressed to the final. They will be taking on Portugal in the final, which takes place at 9 o'clock on Sunday. We hope you'll all join us again then for that one. Thank you ever so much for watching and goodbye for now.